100. You're watching HSN. I'm Suzanne Runyon. I hope you're having an amazing weekend. And I hope you can hang out with me for a couple hours because we have our very favorite rock hound. Jay King is nuts. <laughs> He'll admit it. He'll admit it. This man will go anywhere, literally anywhere, to be able to find his great gemstones. And it's always such an adventure to hang out with him for a little bit because he tells these cool stories, stuff you just can't imagine. And he brings us this awesome jewelry collection that's truly unique, that separates you from the rest of the crowd you might hang out with, which, quite frankly, we all love to do that, right? So let me give you a sneak peek. We have some really Really, really magical pieces coming up in the next two hours, including the two that I have right in front of me. Tanzanite, Tanzanite. Oh, my beloved Tanzanite. How much do I love thee? I do. I loved it. I could do a sonnet. That was almost a sonnet. It's almost Shakespearean. Okay, that's, that's pretty good for me. You have a ballad. I'm going to do a ballad about my love of Tanzanite. I do love Tanzanite. I have been mystified uh, by it, and people have, you have for years and years and years. Tanzanite's really expensive. It's really hard to come by. Look what Jay has done. A huge Tanzanite necklace. This is the genuine real deal. You'll see it all hour. Originally, this is $220, and that's still knowing, and I've been to Africa, I've been to places where they sell Tanzanite right there in Africa, and guess what? It's not $220 even there. It's really expensive, even though you might be in South Africa. Here, tonight, we have a super price on this. Go early, early, early. If you're like me and you dream of owning beautiful Tanzanite, this is your one opportunity. It is the lowest price. We have five flex on everything through Thanksgiving, so this is a great time to pick up that Tanzanite you've been dreaming about. We also have a great bracelet coming up, a stretch bracelet that matches it. And I do have the matching little drop earrings, which are super cute. There's Mitch Angie. She's joining us. I mean, look at that. Glorious Tanzanite and a whole lot of it. Anyway, you can order it now if you'd like to. The second thing, and it's not going to be coming up until towards the end of this first hour. Check this out. This is rhodochrosite. And many of you might be like, I've never heard what rhodochrosite is. Or maybe you've watched lots of Jay's show and you say, oh my goodness, this is 100% brand new. I think it is one of the most beautiful, softest looking necklaces that Jay's done. I love the discs that graduate in size. Then you get a spacer in, in a completely different form. And then you get the round beads all the way back to the silver extension. Again, this is 100% brand new. We've got five flex pays on it. Jay's gonna tell the story of where do you find rhodochrosite, how do you get to it, and so much more coming up in our two hours. Now, that is just a baby teeny teeny look at two items coming up. And I know already many of you just jumped on the lines and you're picking up that Tanzanite piece because you and I both know if you love Tanzanite, that is an incredible, incredible value to grab. Do not miss out on that. It's gonna be coming up in just a couple of minutes, but if you wanna order early, please do. Okay, so I'm super, <laughs> it's love at first sight when you see some of this stuff, right? And this, I loved. I go, oh, Jay's doing a smoky quartz. Okay, I love smoky quartz. I especially love it in the fall, the winter. I love to wear it with my jeans or a lot of Diane Gilman. Oh, he's never done anything like this before. Look how cool this smoky quartz is. It's cubes. He did cubes of smoky quartz. So check this out, guys. We're gonna go nice and close so you can see it. Look at this funky, cool earring to go with it. I love, love, love to see a unique shape like cubes and rounds. And then, of course, we've got this amazing stretch bracelet. I think this is a showstopper piece. I think it's a piece when you wear it, people are gonna stop you and say, oh my gosh, what gallery did you buy that in? Oh, wh what fancy store? Did you go on vacation and get to a really cool place that had neat jewelry? Grab it. Smoky Quartz is one of my all-time favorite stones, only because it virtually matches everything. All right, well, I certainly couldn't do my two hours well without getting the amazing, fabulous, oh, so handsome, and oh, so talented Jay King to join me. Here he is, the man himself, the legend, Jay King. I am a legend in my own mind, <laughs> and I do appreciate the fact that you think I am, too. Yes, so... <laughs> Well, there's a group of two now, so there we go. Yeah, it's probably the only two in planet Earth. But, I mean, as long as we got two. I mean, then we can, we, can have a, we can have a vote. That's Give true. Give a majority. Wait, yes, that's very true. <laughs> okay, Jay, I love what you did here. This is so you know, wildly different. It, it is totally cool. I really like it. It's, it's very retro. But, you know, just so everybody knows this, you know, um, when you see smoky quartz out there, believe it or not, you know, if all the colored quartzes, and I know this is hard to believe, but of all the colored quartzes, do you know that smoky quartz is, is right up there, probably in the top 
five most expensive colored quartzes. Just so everybody knows, okay? So if, if you're not clued in on it, amethyst is a colored qu quartz. Citrine, colored quartz. Uh, uh, rose quartz, colored quartz. Uh, you know, uh, you know, ametrine, uh, colored quartz. There's so many different colored quartzes out there uh, on planet Earth, but smoky quartz is one of the rarer uh, of the colors and it's also one of the most expensive mm. that you get. This was a uh, material that we brought in Brazil, oh my gosh, uh, it, uh, over five years ago, maybe even go on as, on as much as seven. This was the very last design that we did. We, we don't have any material. The only material I actually have in this right now is um, in my specimen case, in my man cave. Okay. That's the only, only specimen I have of this particular lot. Um, it's really, really difficult. It's not that I don't know where to go get it, okay? A lot of my sources in Uruguay, a lot of my uh, sources in Brazil have it, but uh, to be honest with you, in this quality, um, th there's no way that we could even come in close to, the, to these values. I mean, it, it would well, just be impossible. And guys, you know what's really interesting? So Dixon is my director, and he went in really, really tight on this. Look at the quality of the stones. You did cubes. If you have really bad smoky quartz, those stone, you would see every imperfection just almost magnified because he dared to do a cube as opposed to a whole bunch of facets. And facets actually play with the light, so it allows you to kind of disguise more inferior stones in a way, you know, because you can kind of, it's like a house of mirrors. You don't quite know where to look. With this, you're showing off the quality of the smoky quartz. Now here's the scoop. I get ready for the show and Jay and I chat and I looked over the entire show. Almost everything in the show, I have 300 or 400 or less of literally everything. And this is one of those that's included, okay? We do not have a lot of this. This is 100% brand new. It's very limited. Um, can we do this, um, uh, Pat? Can you give me an update? So we've got the stretch bracelet, just so fun. And by the way, these cubes are also smooth. So it's not that you're getting poked by a corner. You guys are loving this necklace. I'm so happy you're getting it. This is gonna be the showstopper. This is the one that you wear and it's funky and it's cool and it's different. You've got a, maybe a jean jacket on and you've got a turtleneck on and you throw it on and those cubes just, I think, are so much fun. It's nice to see a different shape in jewelry as opposed to some of the traditional shapes we're normally used to. And I'm so glad that you love it. You're totally responding to this one. I'm tickled because I'm glad you are because I love it too. I think it's so cool. Now, if you're brand new, Jay, on virtually every single necklace will do a two and three quarter inch extender, extension. That's in sterling silver. Yep, a little sterling silver. He's sending you some love and it's puff heart and best clasp ever made in the history of all jewelry. It does not come unhooked when you're wearing it, but it is easy to hook. So you don't have to fight with a little C ring or a teeny little clasp you can't see. You got a nice big clasp. It's very easy to work with, but it does stay put when you're wearing it. Jay, I know you've got more to share with us. I love the fact you went for the cube shave because again, even cutting the cubes, takes a lot of art because, and a lot of skill, because they have to be the exact same size on every side. Right, and you know, and these are, these, these are all cut from the natural rough material. So, so anybody cool. who's ever, if you've ever gone to any show, right, and you've ever seen like uh, amethyst crystals or, um, you know, th this is the same thing. It comes in a crystal. It comes in a, a quartz crystals is what it looks like. It is a colored quartz. Another thing which I think that you pointed out uh, so well, Look how clean this material is. Okay, normally, now some of them, I'm not gonna say they're all perfectly clean. We got, you know, those right there are perfectly clean. Some of them are gonna have just a little bit of rutilation in it, but that's how you can tell it's real. Um, a lot of people that, that have this material, unfortunately, okay, I will guarantee you that uh, I've seen it in department stores. I've even seen it at the Tucson Gem Show where it's beautiful material, but it's not real, it's glass. So, <laughs> you know, but a lot of times, you know, when you're buying it, unless you're cutting it from the, from actually from the crystal rough, the actual rough material, you really don't know what you're getting. And I guarantee you we cut this, um, it's all cut from our natural rough. We do it all by hand. And this is the exceptional quality. This was the last of the last of the last of the material I had. Yeah, and it's great looking and it's so fun. Okay, we have about 90 of the necklaces left and then that's good. 90, I have 90 for the whole country, 80 million households, something like that. Um, in the bracelet, I have 95 bracelets left. This is stretch. So really easy to put on. It's very comfortable when you're wearing it. It just looks substantial. It's very fun. Wear this with all the browns, all the wonderful rust colors we love in the fall. As we move into winter, it just, it, smoky quartz to me is a force 
seasons don't. Um, I love wearing it in the summer with all the khakis we wear and all the whites and smoky quartz looks great with that. You are gonna have a ball. Red looks really good with smoky quartz too. You can't go wrong with this one. Okay, uh, the necklace is almost gone. The bracelet's gonna follow that. And then look how cute these little cubular earrings are. They are adorable and they are one and seven eighths of an inch long. You have a little sterling silver shepherd's hook on the top. Just absolutely so fantastic. All right, I will keep you updated. We are busy little bees already, so I'll keep you updated on this, all right? Hey, tis the season to give away money. Oh, did I get your attention? <laughs> I hope so. Well, here's what we're doing. If you pick up our HSN card right now, we're gonna give you $20 towards that very first purchase you make using the card. Well, that's great. I mean, that's a lot of money. That's a big savings. Um, what's even better is all the deals you have access to once you have our card. To get the details, go to hsn.com. All right, now we're moving on, moving on. This is a clearance price. Now, we have several items in the show where we're doing what I call kind of the rock bottom deals on rocks. So it's rock deals on rock and jewelry. Um, this is one of those, and I have several coming up. So if you're saying, well, I want to give Jay for a gift, and I'm saying, hey, you know, or you want to try his jewelry, some of these clearance items are fantastic. And what happens with our clearance is it's not clearance because no one liked them. It's just we have a little bit left. And trust me, it's very little left. And we're just putting it on clearance and kind of moving it out uh, because Jay has so many more new things coming in. All right, three pieces of this collection. You have the earrings available. We have the necklace available, and we have the ring. And if if you're not new to Jay, what's really fun is he's going to put a great big bail on there so you can actually take the pendant off. And that by itself is that 119.23. Sure, looks fantastic. You also get the pendant to go with it. So all of this for 119. 23. Then the earrings obviously are in sterling silver. And then we have a really, really pretty ring. I want you to see how pretty this ring is. Look at that. Just a gorgeous and once again, very unique shape. This is highly unusual when you see a stone that's actually been uh, hand carved like this. All right, Jason, let's jump into it. Swazi green stone. Okay, well, this, okay. The, the reason I would buy this right now, well, it's just a crazy value. This is part of our gallery collection. Mm -hmm. um, this is what Mind Finds is all about. You're never gonna, number one, these designs are, are our designs. I mean, I, they're exclusive just for the show. So you won't, you won't see this design anywhere. Look at the craftsmanship, look at the attention to detail. These are all individually hand done by us. All the silver work is done by our silversmiths, huge. Uh, you know, huge thing for us. No, you know, m most jewelers couldn't even do this because these all have to be, uh, you have to take the actual cabochon that's in the pendant, the ring, the earrings, the, the lapidaris has to cut that from the rough material, and then the silversmiths literally build the silver work around it. This isn't, you know, uh, kind of like glue and paste type thing, right, where a lot of it is, where they do stampings and they do castings and they just glue it, you know, they cut a stone and glue it in there. This is really actually built. Uh, these are all li literally uh, pieces of wearable art. What I love about this, okay, where are you going to, this is, okay, 45 years of doing this, 45 years professionally doing it. And I say professionally because I've been paying taxes for 45 years, okay? <laughs> we did it, I did it in college and, and maybe didn't adhere to that rule, right? But, um, you know, professionally, uh, you know, uh, for 45 years I've been doing it. This is the very first material I ever got out of Swaziland, okay, in Africa. Uh, it's, it's a really... Um, uh, you know, I, I I wish I could find more materials there. I would love to go. It's one of the places. I have a friend that actually found this. He was doing a, uh, he he was do, he's actually in the safari business, and he was uh, he's the one that kind of got this all started and turned us onto it naturally. And he's a South African, and that's how we found it. It's not Swaziland's not really a destination spot for uh, finding uh, gem materials, or there, there's not a lot of mining that goes on there. So if you want something that's unique, if you want something that's different, you got it right here, okay? And you got all three, I think, because you have a unique, um, rare material. Okay? I, I don't know if anybody else, I've never seen anybody else, I've never even seen this material any place else, okay? This was kind of a one and done for us when we uh, bought the rough material. Exclusive designs, only done by us, you won't see this any place else, and at a price that you get, you know, you just, you just can't do it any better than that, you know? Um, uh, I could even, when we manufacture normally, the prices that we originally show things at, you have to understand, we cut out all the middlemen, right? You're buying about as mine direct as you can buy. So when they come in and they discount these, and here again, 
it's not on clearance. If you read the reviews, it's not on clearance because people didn't like it, right? It's just that we really don't have very many of them left. There's no way to repeat on this material. And so what they do, instead of the inventory just sitting there, um, you know, they come and they have events like this and they give you just an unbelievable crazy price. It's fun too. I mean, it's really fun. We're uh, basically $70 off. And here's the thing, if you're shopping with us for the first time, and I love it because there's so many of you doing that. Um, this is jewelry that's so distinct and it becomes part of who you are and a part of who you want to project. And um, I've been a jewelry fan since I was a little girl. My mom loved jewelry. My dad even loved jewelry. They did a lot of Native American style jewelry. My parents used to create it. Um, and so I've had a love affair with uh, really beautiful stones and jewelry for many, many years. And you might have too. And when you're watching Jay's show, this is something that's so beautiful and unique. When you're talking about the holiday season, who wouldn't want a gorgeous green necklace? And it doesn't have to be a faux or a fake or some like weird painted green thing you bought just because it's Christmas, you know? You can get the real thing. I also love a little tip. Take this pendant where it was a sterling silver necklace. Take a collar or a shorter sterling silver necklace and put the pendant here and let this part of the necklace just highlight it or frame it or outline it. And so still available though, if you want to get this one, again, very limited across the board on sale for the very first time. So never has there been a better deal than right there. Now, I got to remind you of this. I love, love, love this. Oh, it's so cool, you guys. It's going to be sold out here in a sec. Here we go. So here we go. In the bracelet, which I have on my hot little hand here, I have 50 left, 5-0. So cool, it just stretches, so you don't have to baby, you don't have to worry really about your wrist size, see there's plenty of room on there, okay? There's 50 left here. The necklace, which is just knock your socks off, fabulous. There's 60 here, and I have 77 of the earrings. I think the earrings are darling, even if you just wear those alone. If you wear a lot of denim and you've never ever worn smoky quartz with it, go for this. But this design specifically can go to a really nice evening dinner out or it can be very casual with your denim jeans, okay? Because because uh, it's really a very unique design. So that's your update on our smoky. We will let you know when that is sold out. Don't wait, don't wait, don't wait. All right, here we go. Tanzanite, oh, my heart be still. I have had a long time love affair with Tanzanite. I really have. Um, and it's because I just think the stone's beautiful. It's this really magical combination of like purples, like shades of purples, really definitely going into the violets. And purple happens to be my favorite color. So that's why I'm a little partial to it. But for years, I wanted tanzanite. And tanzanite can be very, very expensive. And I was very blessed to go to South Africa, not once, but I've been there twice. And before I was gonna go out to see where Nelson Mandela was actually imprisoned on an island, there is a series of stores that are right near the boat that takes you out to the island. So I was wandering around and I found a Tanzanite store. True story, this is so funny. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's a store in Tanzanite. And of course I've been doing jewelry for many years over two networks. I used to be at our sister network before here. I've been talking about jewelry for like 25 years. So I'm like, well, when in Rome, you know, do as the Romans do. A Tanzanite in South Africa, okay, it's Tanzania. I wasn't in Tanzania, but at least closer than I am here. So I thought, oh my gosh, I'm gonna get the best Tanzanite ever, and I'm gonna get it at the cheapest price because, well, at least it's a neighboring country, right? It's kind of nearby. So I walked in the store, I'll never forget. They first off, they had to unlock the door. That should have been my first clue that it was gonna be way, I should have stopped right there and just said, don't even go in. But I still, little happy me, I go in, and I say hello to the person behind the counter. I look down at the Tanzanite, I see the prices, I look back up at the person at the counter, spun around and walked out of the store. It was insanely expensive. But ever since then, I've had such a love affair of owning Tanzanite pieces. So kind of a long story, but it is very rare. It only comes from one place in the world. And Jay did it. Look at this, a full necklace of some of the most exotic stones in the world, which is a Tanzanite. It's beautiful. Now I have the matching earrings and I do have uh, the matching stretch bracelets. I'm wearing these. So if you want something just really easy to wear, very comfortable, we do have the bracelets available too. So Jay, you heard my long drawn out story about Tanzanite, but I will never forget the moment I thought I was going to finally get my first Tanzanite piece. Do you know, um, you know that it's it's kind of cool you tell tell that story because if people realize, um, it's just like um, you know if you go to Australia, and Opal, you see right. Australian opal here on our show, yeah, and then you see what what they sell for, where they mine it, and see what they get for it, and then you have sticker shock. I mean, you know, <laughs> right. and here again, that there's no, that's what it's worth. That's what it normally costs. It's that's right. just by us being able to do what we do and do our magic, that we're able to offer you the kind of values that we offer. Now, okay, 
I want to let everybody know, okay, heads up here, okay, um, Tanzanite is, uh, I have a love affair with it. I mean, I love this material. Uh, to find it, I have a great source um, right now, and they haven't found any in a long time. Okay, they're just not getting this. It comes from one small geographic area in Tanzania. That's what it's named after. Um, it's not more than 50 square miles. Now, there's not just one big operation. There's, there's numerous claims in, in, that, in that area. Um, right now, they're, they're not getting any material. And they're really, really high-grade material that you see in gold. And you've seen it when you go to the jewelry stores. I mean, if it, a lot of that material even is enhanced or it's treated. But the natural material that's untreated is through the roof. It's, it's, it's expensive or more expensive in most cases than diamonds. Um, this material right here we have, this is the natural color of it. And that's what I want everybody to know. Okay, I also want to let you know this. I have no more of this material. I'm, it's really sad. In fact, these two specimens that are sitting in front of me right here, which I don't know if we can get a good shot of them or, or whatever. I mean, but it, it's kind of hard to show. The, the thing is, that, that, that's it. That's all I have left. I mean, I have nothing. Hmm. I have the specimens that are going to, these are my specimens for my specimen case. And the, this is the crystal. And you can see how this is, this, this is actually a portion of a crystal. You see the front on that? And I'm showing you the crystal. That's a crystal. That's a tanzanite crystal. That's how this comes, guys. And that's how this all started. Now, I'm telling you right now that I, I, I'm i hopeful that down the road, I'm going to be able to get more rough. But right now, even if, even if I could make a deal next week, do you realize it would take anywhere from six months to a year before you would actually physically be able to to put it in a show or see it in a show at least a year from the time that we got it out of the country, got it to the cutting shop, put it in a show, because we write our shows way out. We're already, we're already halfway through um, next year, uh, way, way beyond uh, that. We're even working, we're working on today's specials and everything for the end of 2022. That's how far we have to work out with things. So I will guarantee you, I've got a few bits and drabs of Tanzanite that'll be coming up through May but nothing like this. And you're not gonna see, I guarantee you, I don't have a necklace this size. Mm -hmm. I don't have anything this size. This is, if you want Tanzanite, you'd like to get it from us, okay? I don't, uh, like I said, this, the quality, the, the price and the quality is just phenomenal for the quality of this material. This is natural Tanzanite. It's not color enhanced. It's the real deal, it's the real color. The majority of the tanzanite that you're seeing out there now that would be in a necklace like this, that would even be more expensive than that. The majority of it is what they call platinum tanzanite, which is more of a silver kind of tanzanite, which they've color enhanced. They do a heat treat to it or they do a laser treat to it. And they, they actually bring out that color and make it look that color. So what they're doing is they're aging it, whereas this has been aged by mother nature. Right. Um, that they're enhancing the color. So they're uh, taking what mother nature uh, had it in a certain stage and they're enhancing that color. Right. So it's the natural color. It, it will be the color of tanzanite, but it's not the, the natural color of it. Right. This is the real deal. And this is a really an opportunity. One of the last opportunities you want tanzanite from me uh, to really get in on it. And what I love with these, these are just, these are designs that are simple, contemporary designs that just aren't gonna sit in your jewelry box. Mm -hmm. These are things that you can wear on a daily basis or you can layer with, or it's that perfect accent piece, just like you want a, a strand of pearls or you want something uh, that's black, or you want like a, a strand of, of blue turquoise. You know, uh, there's just certain basics that you really should have. And this is one of the ones that is kind of even beyond a basic, okay? Again, and Tanzanite only comes from that one area, that one location, it does come from several different mining claims, but it comes from that one geographic location in Tanzania.
Okay, just a quick little update for you. We've got the earrings. The earrings come in at one and seven sixteenths of an inch. The bracelet, once again, is a beautiful little stretch bracelet, so it's easy to take on and off. We have never, ever, ever had a better price than this. You are $70 off tonight on this. Uh, is it 70? 80? Yeah, right, 70? $70 off on a beautiful Tanzanite necklace. And again, it's one of the rarest stones in the world because it is only found in one region. Think about that. I mean, you find gold lots of places. You can find turquoise, while it's less and less every year, it's from around the world. We've had turquoise from China. We've had turquoise from here in the U.S. But Tanzanite is in one region, which really adds to its love and collectability. And then the stone itself, I find to be one of the most magical stones out there. It's just beautiful. That yummy, yummy, soft violet color is so pretty and I think so endearing when you're wearing it and when you own it. All right, so we're going to wrap up on that. The necklace, by the way, is 18 inches and the extender is two and three quarters of an inch. I'm sorry, Pat, what did you say? Oh, the pieces. Yeah, let's see them real quick. Um, this is this cute little stretch bracelet. I love it because every single stone is faceted. And again, it's on jewelry, jewelry quality, you know, stretch. So it's going to last. It's easy to take on and off. It's not hard. You don't have to worry about, oh, is it going to fit if I'm going to give somebody Tanzanite for a holiday gift? And then, of course, we have the matching earrings right here. Aren't these little sweet earrings? Three graduated drops. I like how it's lighter and gradually gets a little bit darker down to the biggest drop here. And, of course, that's sterling silver in the shepherd's hook. So there you go. The whole suite, all on sale. Pretty darn amazing. Okay. So a lot of you are asking about the necklace I just put on because I wanted to switch out. Yes, it's coming up. Yes, I think it is. You know what? I've got about three turquoise pieces in the show. All three are very distinct and all three are very, very different. Look how beautiful this one is. Is this not something? Oh my gosh. So it's three layers. It's three strands that have been layered, pre-layered for us. So you can't goof it up, right? And look how gorgeous the color is. This is a combination of turquoise and then I love black spinel. Black spinel is a just really shiny, really sparkly. It just adds a lot of pop to whatever design you use it on. And you're getting three strands. So think about it. What would just this necklace be in turquoise and spinel? All right, let's add a second necklace. Oh, all right, let's just throw in a third one. So three complete necklaces for less than the price of one turquoise necklace you would find elsewhere. 158, that is coming up. It is new. All of this is totally exclusive. And if I didn't mention it earlier, we have five flex on everything through Thanksgiving at 9 p.m. Thanksgiving evening. So take advantage of it. What is it? You might be brand new. Well, it's any major, major credit card. You're going to spread your payments out over five months, but you get the product right away, which is awesome. Okay, so that's coming up. You can order it now if you don't want to wait too much longer. All right, so I'm on the move, right? I shall get up and gracefully try to walk over the other way. <laughs> gracefully, note, I said that. I'm going to, oh, no, daggone it. Yep, I just hit my knee. That was not graceful at all. Did you guys hear that? That hurt. Okay, if it, oh, I can feel it. <laughs> my director says, we didn't hear it, so it didn't happen. Oh, no, my knee felt it. I, you see, I was trying to be graceful, too. It didn't work, did it? All right, hang on. I got to fiddle with my seat. Did you know we were alive? Actually, a friends of mine asked me that. They go, do you tape everything? I go, no, when I hit my knee just a second ago, that is as live as it gets. <laughs> yeah, do we have a live thing? Where's the live thing? Oh, way up there. Oh, up there. Yeah. Well, you know what's really funny? People don't notice that, and they do ask me. And I'm like, oh, yeah, if I fall over, I fall over live. Okay, here we go. Check out how cute these earrings are. <gasps> oh, my goodness. They're so adorable. You know what I forgot to drag over with me was my other samples. <laughs> if you guys can push that over. Thank you. This on the, so, yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You can just sort of shove it. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Okay, here we go. Now, these are absolutely adorbs as can get. We have beautiful stones. It's your choice, and this is very unusual to see. We have peridot, blue topaz, and amethyst. A lot of times, Jay will work with a lot of your opaque stones. These are, of course, going to be your transparent stones. And I love it, the double hearts. This is an easy I love you gift, whether it's for the birthday or whether you're going to do it for Christmas. Who wouldn't want a double heart? Maybe someone's getting married, and you want to give them a little earring that they can wear on their honeymoon. It would be so cute. These are fabulous. And Jay, I love it. I have not seen you do these three stones together actually in a very long time. You know, and these are all three semi-precious. Um, when we do things like this, just so you know, these are what we call standalone designs. So they're standalone earrings. And every now and then, like, I'll just have a ring. Like, you know, we'll design a ring. But it's just so cool that you just, you just put it on as a standalone. This, um, I fell in love with the shape, the double heart, very contemporary. Um, 
you know, all they're all handcrafted. They're all done from scratch by us. But I couldn't I couldn't decide which color <laughs> I was going <laughs> to use. Right. So I you did this, three. And, you know, I thought, and then I thought, you know, what the heck? We'll just <laughs> offer all three. So, but you know, this is a great you know item if you're if you, if you just want something. Um, maybe to just throw on that and you, you don't even this doesn't even have to be matchy matchy right? right this is just something like look look how great um, they look on Ange look you know and here again okay this is mine finds I mean they're they're not some little teeny tchotchke piece right they've got right. they've got nice size to them they've got a nice presence for them and just, you know she, her hair she wears her hair long you know but um, you know that one of the toughest things uh, to do is actually design earrings that if somebody wears their uh, hair down, that you can actually see. They can have the greatest pair of earrings in the world. You know, they can have they can have five carat diamond rocks, right? But you don't even know it, right? <laughs> you have no True. clue. These are something that have enough presence. They're something really nice. But it's something that you know that you can just if you just want a little color, you just want a little accent, or like you know something that you just wear for any occasion or almost every day. Uh, casual or dress, this is uh, something you might want to consider. Now, we are doing something different than, than we used to. It used to be that we would just cost average all of these, and then we would make them all the same price. And what we're doing now is, because the blue tope has, to be honest with you, it's a semi-precious stone, but it costs a heck of a lot more than the amethyst or the peridot do. So this way, um, you know, it's really, you know, you're really you know, getting a great deal. But um, what we used to do is we would sell out of all the blue topaz and then we would have the others left. So that's why they're really priced barely. It's a, it's a great value, a great deal. And I have to tell you, um, one of the things not traveling, which, I, you know, I, I, I am starting to travel again. Um, thank goodness, my wife is so happy. <laughs> I got to tell you, it's like giving her a Christmas present. All right, the best Christmas present that you ever did. You know, she was. Uh, she. She. I think that she really actually enjoys that I leave now, and that I'm. I'm out and about again, and I'm starting to travel, and um, I'm planning on traveling a lot next year. I, I'm hoping we're we're back. I mean, uh, back out there, back in the game. Um, but I will. I will tell you that staying here, and I've I've gone to a lot of jewelry stores. And I've been going to a lot of events. And it really, I, I have to tell you, it brings home the fact that we really do have, I think, some amazing designs. We offer some things that you just don't, I mean, there, there's things, I just don't see anything like what we do out there. Right. And especially, uh, I don't see any, anything with the materials and the values that we're offering. So that makes me really feel good. Well, and Jay, yeah. let me just kind of break it down. So, because I was thinking about that when you mentioned it. So let's just look at the blue topaz. So this one's 80, 89.50, okay? So let's look at it. Okay, each of these stones are a little under a half a carat. So you're almost at one carat total. Not quite, but it's like 85 points. So it's almost a carat. So what would you pay for just, uh, we can, Dixon, can you just go into the blue topaz for me? If you just got a stud blue topaz earring with just, just the stone, see how this is set? So it's set in a bezel. Just, just this, skip everything else. Just do a little basic stud earring. Yeah, look at the silver in the bezel right there. See that little wall of silver around the stone? How much would you spend if you were at a decent jewelry store in the mall? That's gonna be over $89 just for the little stud earrings, just little teeny studs, barely can see them, okay? Then you add all of that silver to it. There's a lot of movement in the heart too. You'll see there's texture to it. It's really unique. It's just not flat, boring hearts. And then of course you have the silver hook, the shepherd's hook over the top. I mean, that is a lot of sterling silver, a lot of design at a really super value. So again, three choices. We have the Ami, Blue Topaz, or you have the Peridot. Uh, by the way, what is the most limited of the three, uh, Pat, if you will? The blue topaz, you guys are loving that one. All right, guys, so stay right there for those. We'll keep you updated. That just makes a super easy gift idea, too. You know, it's not like you have to really, you know, worry about, oh, as long as they have pierced ears, you're good to go. And share some love this holiday season. I think it's so important. All right, don't forget my turquoise spinels coming up already. Several hundred of these have now been ordered. Yeah, you guys are loving it. I know, look at it. It's like, like you can't help but stare at it, right? But before we get there, this is Pilbara, which is really interesting. Almost $100 off. Magical story behind it. I want you guys to see, we have the beautiful long necklace, 18 inches with the extender. You have the pendant that's removable. Look how big that pendant is. If this was a bracelet, 
bracelet. Look at how amazing that cuff would be. Just that one single very unique stone. And look at the coloration. Look at the texturing Jay included for his artisans on the top of that bale. Really, really high, high end. Right now here in the Florida area that we live in, where the studio is, we're having a lot of, um, because it's warm down here, obviously, or warmer, we're having these really fun outdoor, there's a big crafts, arts and crafts event that's all lining the main street here in where we live, right? And there's tons of jewelry at these events and they're handcrafted and the artisans come in and they sell them in their little booths and it's really fabulous. Trust me, you would never, ever, ever, number one, see this stone there. And number two, there is no way this necklace with this very large drop would be $89.95. This would be in the hundreds of dollars right now if you're going to the arts festival that's in our little town right today. It's literally running today. So here's your opportunity to get a very unique stone, a very unique story, and we have the matching earrings to go back to it. Once again, please understand though, very limited, first time ever, $100 off. This is gonna be one of our biggest sale items of the two hours. So Jay, where did you find this stone? Because I love the coloration, it's very unique. Well, believe it or not, it comes from Australia, and it comes oh, interesting. from a little community called Pilbara. Oh, wow, <laughs> so, <laughs> really? Is that like out is, in the sticks, like the opal mines oh, are, or where? Uh, what, Pilbara? Um, well, okay, Pilbara, when you're driving through, if you spit, you'll miss the town, okay? <laughs> <laughs> you, just, you, you say, well, it's Pilbara. Well, um, you know, remember when you spit? You just, you just, we just drove through. Okay. <laughs> it, no, it's not uh, what you call modern uh, metropolis. It's actually out in the Aboriginal uh, oh, areas. Interesting. Um, and, uh, and and actually, my uh, the friend who mines this, he actually has a deal with uh, with the elders, with the tribe. And he, oh, wow. you know, you you have to have you have to have permission. I mean, you know, like you just don't go out there and start digging, right? <laughs> I mean, then, you know, it's. It, you know, and yeah, also, you know, you're benefiting the the tribe, the locals. I mean, everybody benefits from it. But it's one of those just unique, crazy materials that we get, and that's really what Mind Finds is about. But this is just, again, I mean, the value of this, the price, you couldn't build it. You cannot build it and sell it for this price. And we are the manufacturers, okay? But I want you to pay attention to this. Look, okay, look at the one that Suzanne had. Look at the one that Ange has here, right? They're all really one of a kind looks. There's no two of them. It's, it's impossible to make these matchy matchy. They're, it's all cut from the natural pil pilbara material. Um, the, these are all hand dut. There is no, there's nothing here that is not made from scratch by right. us. Okay, right. it's all completely hand manufactured. That's so cool. It's just a beautiful piece too. And again, as you mentioned, I, I loved Angie's. It was very, very red looking. I've got some of the reds, got a lot of browns in here. There's actually grays, a little bit of ivory, which is kind of unique. All right, we're gonna wrap up on that one. So stay right there. I only have about 400 necklaces left and I only have about 85 of the earrings remaining. So not a lot. All right, I wanna show you this. Now I will say it is not an exact match to the necklace, but we're gonna kind of pair them together. It's a little more of a green turquoise, but look how beautiful this is. Jay, a couple years ago, decided to do something very difficult and it's to make manufacture a stretch bracelet that look, looks like it is not. It looks more like a bangle bracelet. Very, very hard to do. Tons of sterling silver used in here. This is just a quick preview of it, 149 and we have it on five flex pays. It is new and it's just absolutely stunning, stunning, stunning. So I'm gonna pop that one on as we move on to this necklace. Oh my gosh, can you stand it? Where you're kind of channel surfing and you're like, oh, whoa, what is that necklace she has on? Well, we finally gotten to it. And I will tell you several hundred have already been ordered just from you guys seeing it, uh, just that one little sneak peek. It's a triple strand that's already strung for you. You can't goof it up. You also can twist this if you wanna do what's called a trissade, which is a completely different look. Maybe Angie will get a chance to do that. This is so pretty and it's one of those necklaces that just pops when you wear it. And it goes with everything I'm wearing. I think this is a very old Marla Wynn. It is a turtleneck that's actually a tunic length. Great. I got it on with my Diane Gilman jeans. Uh, you know, blah, blah, blah. It's fine. But then you can turn around and wear it with straight denim. You can dress this up because I think spinel always adds when you use black spinel, it takes such a great shine and it facets so beautifully that it always elevates anything to a really almost holiday glitz and glamour. And that is what Day, uh, Jay has done with this one. I love this. I think this is the showstopper of the entire two hours. I really do. I do have a really big, if you want lots of turquoise, I've got a great item coming up next hour. Uh, but this one is just one of those 
types of necklaces that I think you'll reach for constantly. And I love multi-strand. My favorite necklace, I actually wore it on the air the other day, is a five-strand multi-strand necklace in turquoise from Jay. And I had it on and I just love wearing them. There's just something uh, easy and relaxed and fun about it. But again, this one is elevated because of that great black spinel. The length on is 18 inches. And again, you have two and three quarters on the extender on the back. We have taken, what's well, brand new today, so it's the first time you're seeing it. And I just give you a little heads up. Again, I do not have a lot of these. In fact, my producer just noted 275 left and then this is sold out. I do not think it's gonna last very long. Just give you a little heads up. All right, Jay, so what turquoise did you use in this design? Okay, it's not just the turquoise. <laughs> it's the material that I didn't wanna give up. <laughs> this is stuff, of just course. so you know, guys, okay, to see this, and I, I'm glad everybody's responding to this, but it breaks my heart in the fact, it doesn't break my heart that you love it as much, but you do realize how rare this is, okay? This is the kind of stuff that I hoard that they make me, they make me put this in designs <laughs> and turn loose of this. I would keep this in my, I would keep it in my, in my man cave and just stare and play with these on a daily basis, okay? These are all sea foam nuggets, okay? Wow, cool. Th th this is, okay, it, they're really, really rare, guys. Th look at the color on these. This it's is so this blue. is like beyond Robin's egg blue. This is all natural too. The, you know, th this is the color glow in the dark turquoise. This is yeah. this is beyond Sleeping Beauty. I mean, and, and also the sea foam nuggets. You, you just don't get them. Not every deposit. It's it's a rarity, even on how they're formed, right? Um, it's a, it's it's very rare that any turquoise deposit has sea foam nuggets. Um, the, when you see these, they actually look like turquoise pieces of foam. I mean, the, the nuggets are just incredible. Um, very, very limited. Uh, I've had these forever and a day. I've kept them back, kept them back. I, I tell you what I do, and you know, you know we, we make everything from scratch, guys, okay? But every time that we get any material, any material that we have, it goes through three steps. Right when it comes in the door, to the warehouse, okay? The, 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 before we do anything with it, before we design with it, anything, they all do the same thing. They come in, they're sized. Then they go through um, a color process where we pick them out uh, by color, and then the material is graded. This is the top, top, not only on size, the, the, the material itself, the seafoam material and the color, this is the stuff that is all put back, okay? Very seldom do I, you know, I always keep this. I even hate designing with it, to tell you the truth, because I just am so attached to it. You're such a baby. It. But You're what a great a look. baby. <laughs> okay, but you look at this, I guarantee you, look at our aunt. You're not gonna see this anywhere. You're not gonna, there's no jewelry store. Stuff. Even if you went out to, if you went out to Santa Fe, if you went to Taos, right. and anybody even had anything like this, Sedona, right? right. Any of those places, yeah. and they have something in this quality, in seafoam nuggets, it, look at the price of it and see what they get, even for a one strand. If you could get a one strand of it, you're getting three strands. And we did the black spinel for two reasons, okay? And it also has um, uh, sterling silver, um, uh, uh, liquid silver, in, uh, Which in I some love of that, it. some of and the spacers. We, okay, but we did that for a reason. It's actually done so that they act as pivot points, so that when you put this on, it lays perfectly. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you right now, this is the piece, okay? This is the creme de la creme of this hour. I love um, it. This, this material is through the roof, rare, unbelievable, but look at the color consistency. The main thing is when they go in tight on these, you don't even have to go on tight. Look at this, these are sea foam nuggets, okay? I mean, you just don't come by that very often. Hey Jay, it's just, just real quick. really, really very, very rare. And this is gonna be sold out. Y'all have to go now. Okay, like I know we've got still another hour and 15 minutes to go. We've got lots and we do we have great surprises now Good news is I do have other turquoise coming up that I think is gonna blow your mind But nothing like this. There's absolutely nothing like this and Jay said it too If you were just to go into a store in Santa Fe and I've been blessed to be down there a lot You know what would just one really unique turquoise like this be with spinel, right? I mean, what would just this necklace cost? Okay, we'll ask them to add a second one to it Oh, and by the way, can you give me three necklaces for the same price as that first one? I mean, it's just it's 
unheard of. This is gonna be gone though. And you know what's really cool? There's only like a couple hundred of these that'll ever be out and about. So when you wear yours, you don't see yourself coming and going, right? Oh uh, yeah, my producer's like, Sue, you gotta move on. <laughs> like, that means I also have to take it off. I know. We'll let you know when it's gone, it is gone. Okay, so we'll keep you updated on that. And did you see how easy it was for me to take it off without a mirror? It's because this is the best hook ever in jewelry. I don't know why everybody has not knocked Jay off on it. I really don't. <laughs> I'm not sure I should have said that, but... Oh, the church bangle. Oh, okay, guys. I'm going to show you two minutes on this, and then we will get to this next item because it's pretty cool. But here it is. Love this. This is brand new. I also have a ring that I think looks great back to it. This is very difficult for Jay to be able to make. Now, a couple years ago, Jay, you know, he does a lot of stretch bracelets, but, you know, they're obviously stretch bracelets. You can tell by seeing them. For example, my... Uh, my um, Blah, 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 tanzanite. This is stretch, and when you look at it, you go, okay, that's a stretch bracelet, we get it. Okay, that makes sense. This looks like it's a bangle bracelet, but watch this, it's stretch. So it acts and plays like a bangle, it has that bold look like a bangle, but you have the comfort and the ease of putting it on and off because it is a stretch design. Now, look at that, love the hammered texture. Then, do you know how hard it is to do a turquoise and to hand carve it so that it curves and that it also slightly goes down a little bit? You can see that is very, very difficult difficult to make these kind of turquoise carvings work. They're very, very hard. All right, this is 149. It's also new. It's 100% exclusive. And I've got 300 left. And much like my necklace, which is almost gone, I think this is not going to be around very long. Just to give you the size real quick, because I'm trying to look it up. It's the seven to seven and a half inch wrist. And again, you're just slipping it over your knuckles because it's got stretch. You don't have to worry about it too much. So Jay, kind of walk us through this one. This turned out so beautiful. Okay, this is um, this is part of our gallery edition. I mean, these are the things that we do, and it's you know all of us. Uh, we all started the same way um, uh, in my company. We all started off by making one of a kind designs. Uh, we would sell at trade shows, or we would go to um, you know to a lot of fashion bo uh, boutiques, higher end type boutiques. I did a lot of bridge jewelry stores where they sold platinum diamonds, and then we did. Uh, we did the you know the lower end market we also did what they call bridge jewelry or i did a lot of my designs actually back then I used to do in 14 18 karat gold um these are the kind of designs that that uh, as designers what what we what we would design and this is you're not going to see this anywhere else okay and i guarantee you when you do see it you're not going to see it for that price this is like really really super contemporary really cool uh, we don't make a lot of them like i said this is part of the gallery edition this was something that we designed originally. We were gonna to try to do it as a today special. Mm. Um, but we ended up doing, uh, uh, you know, util utilizing our kind of our uh, design technology to do something else. But this was the one that we didn't go with. It's just got so much silver present. And here again, yeah, okay guys, look at the, how these are done, how they're formed. You're not gonna see anything like this. And I guarantee you when you wear this, and people don't know your little mind find secret, <laughs> no telling what they're gonna think that you paid for this, no right? Kidding. This is a super, super high-end look. It really is a cool, cool design, very comfortable, easy to wear, and looks great with almost anything. Yeah, guys, this is really such a good one, too. And it, I love the idea of being la layering it. If you have a silver tone or a silver watch, how fun would that be to match it and really pull that silver out? Maybe you've got a textured big cuff bangle you love wearing, and you're going to put this against it. Maybe you have a lot of silver bangles, and you want to actually break it up with some texture and some color. This is perfect. And again, really limited. All right, our three-strand is officially sold out. I hope you guys love that. Do not fear, though. I do have some pretty magnificent turquoise coming up next hour, one called Maiden Hair. Can't wait to hear the story behind that, but officially that is sold out. Stay right there if you're on the line for the bracelet because that's very limited too. All right, so now we're gonna move on to this next piece. And yeah, we're gonna talk about this one because again, very distinct. The fun thing about tuning in for Jay's shows are you just never know what to expect. And I always say, expect the unexpected when Jay is here because no two things are ever alike and everything's so unique. And that's what I love about wearing jewelry. I love wearing jewelry that has personal, look at that. 
You can flip it over if you want to. You can wear it this way, you can wear it this way. It's pretty cool. You can take this off and wear this by itself for a really dramatic piece or just wear this on a sterling silver chain. How magnificent would that be with this really large, large, big pendant uh, hanging off a, st a sterling silver chain? So in this case, we're talking about the Oasis Stone. This is clearance. It's $80 off. This is one of our biggest sale items in the two hours. And we have the matching earrings. They come in very quickly at about one and three quarters of an inch long. So where do you find Oasis Stone, Jay? And how would you describe the color of this stone? Well, if you go in tight on this, and that's that's one of the things when you're showing it, you know, kind of at a distance like this, um, this is, it's really, it's kind of really more unique, um, kind of like an indigo kind of color to it. It's um, kind of green. It's pretty bizarre. It's almost like a platinum indigo. Uh, uh, what makes this so unique and so different is this the kind of materials that you don't see. Nobody, nobody, uh, uh, you're, you're not going to see this any other jewelry designer has ever even probably would even know about this, or um, this is one of those unique mine finds. Um, there is actually footage of me um, actually flying over this this uh, this mine uh, in a helicopter. I was in a Robinson R44 that day, and we were actually flying out uh, to some other mining areas, mining deposits that we were gonna do some footage and some filling, and I was also buying at that time and we flew right over where this is mined. And it's a great shot, and it would explain why they call it Oasis Stone, okay? Because it's in the middle of, of Australia. It's in the middle of the outback. And I'm telling you, we're flying along, and it looks like the moonscape, right? And you can, out there, you can all of a sudden, you can see some palm trees. And then, sure as heck, you get right there, and you go right over it. The most beautiful almost like something out of National Geographic, <laughs> beautiful, uh, like turquoise green water. And it's and because it's the only water in the whole area, um, you'll have, uh, it's got the palm trees. A lot of times when you fly over it, you'll see camels there. Uh, you see kangaroos. I mean, everybody comes, that's their watering hole. So it's not really a place you want to camp at night <laughs> or any place like that. But that, there there it is right there. That's that's actually on that trip. I don't know if we'll go over there. Was, that was, uh, I was, that's a Robinson Arch right there. There's the oasis right there. That, that, you can't really see the trees there, but there are, there's actually, um, there's actually palm trees that are on that one side, but that's the oasis. And that's, that's, the day that we went out there, and that was that's actually the Oasis Stone right there. That Isn't is so that cool? cool. Yeah, look at that. And those are <laughs> emus, kangaroos. Oh my gosh. I mean, th those are goats. Now, those are th those goats. They have quite a history to them. They're from Spain, right? Yeah. And uh, they're not they're not native of Australia like so many things. They were brought there, and those goats are crazy. They will, they'll if you leave, you can't leave like anything like out they'll come and eat it. Even the planes <laughs> and stuff like that, you know, like at night, um, you gotta, they put their dogs out because, you know, people have come out and they have literally, they'll eat the fabric off your aircraft. Stop it, that's crazy. I mean, they're crazy. just insane. Oh man, they just eat anything. Pretty <laughs> that's cool. That's funny. Well, at least the goats are like the goats here. You know what I mean? They'll eat anything too. So that just puts me a part of its DNA. All right, guys, we have to wrap this one up. Again, you're getting the necklace with the pendant. They can be worn separate. You can put them together or um, you also have the earrings. That's another option as well. And I love it because the pendant has still, still Silver on both sides. So you can really have some fun and look, change the design as you change your outfit or your mind. All right, guys, now we're going to end this portion of the first hour with this gorgeous rotocrosite. All right, we gave you guys a peek at it right at the top of the hour. I do have these darling, darling little matching earrings to go with it, all done in sterling silver. And these are brand new. So brand new rotocrosite tonight. Uh, the earrings are one and sixteenths of an inch. The necklace, once again, is 18 inches. And if you're just kind of tuning in, Jay always does a two and three quarter inch sterling silver extender on his 18 inch necklaces so you really do have a lot of length to work with and obviously all the links in between are going to allow you to customize just the right position for this necklace. You need a little higher because you're wearing a blouse or you need a little lower because you've got a turtleneck on like I do. This is a great piece. So Jay, what do you love about rotocrosite? Okay, well everybody needs to understand on this too, this material. Uh, it only comes from one location in the world that I'm aware of. Now there are places maybe you can find specimens, but all the rhodochrosite is mined in one mine. Uh, it's actually a cavern in Argentina. And this comes from um, the, you're looking at a stalactite or a stalagmite is how they mine it, right? And that, that's how they 
they get it. Now, here's the thing that which makes rhodochrosite so special in this quality. Okay, this is this is my rhodochrosite. And you can see actually, you see there, that's the outside of the stalactite or the stalagmite. And then that's what was the inside. And all I'd done to this is to just hit it with a leather wheel and buffed it up. So this is where it all starts with us, right? It's the natural materials. Here's what makes this such a rarity and something really you might want to consider for your collection. Rotocrosite, um, over 10 years ago, over a decade ago, the Argentinian governor, government came in and they said, look, we're not going to allow the export of the, of the rotocrosite rough anymore. It all has to be in a finished product. Well, you know, there's not a lot of people that have cutting shops in Argentina, right? And so, and there's not really a lot of value in setting up a shop just to exclusively cut rotocrosite. Um, so you couldn't buy the rough material up till two years ago. It, it's not available. I bought this about seven, eight years ago, maybe even a little bit longer. And I want you to really pay attention when you see this on Ange or you, uh, Suzanne when you're showing it to it. The quality is through the roof. This is all the gem grade material. And this material we actually bought uh, from an elderly gentleman who was a, a custom designer and a manufacturer. He only worked in 18 and 22 karat gold. He only specialized in gem quality rhodochrosite and gem quality lapis. That's all he did, okay? Look at the color consistency of this. This almost like, the, you know, I, I know you're probably not rhodochrosite experts, but you don't see this quality. Right. I mean, this is like the top, top, top quality of rhodochrosite that you're looking at here right now. The top colors. Again, this material originally um, was slated to be cut into cabochons and it would have gone into uh, either 18 or 22 karat uh, uh, jewelry designs. Um, we were able to get the rough material. This is some of the last of the last of the rough. Now, about three years ago, the last Tucson show that I went to Tucson Gem and Mineral, there was a gentleman there from Argentina and he had four or five barrels of rhodochrosite. And I, I approached him, I asked him, how in the heck did you get that out? I mean, you know, like you must have that forever in Tucson. He goes, no, I've got a, I've got a contract with the government. We're gonna start being able to export it. And I thought, okay, great, I've got his card, in fact. Um, but I will tell you right now, okay, the prices that they're getting for it, if I would have cut this necklace, I think you would have had sticker shock, okay, for this quality. He did have this quality, this Jimmy, Jimmy quality, but they get huge, huge money for it. So if you want rotocrosite, this isn't something that I'll continue to be able to do, but this is some of my last remaining rotocrosite material that I had from that purchase that I did. And this was kind of like, the last of the last of the material. I always save the best for last. And I just think this is such a unique, such a contemporary look in a very, very unusual material. You just don't see rhodochrosite out and about. And you really don't see it, you know, uh, every day in designs. And if you do, I guarantee you don't see it in this quality. Normally they reserve this quality for either, uh, either gold or um, they're, they're real high end high-end designer silver pieces. But normally it's in 14, 18, 22 karat gold. Yes, and I think, once again, when it comes to, if you love jewelry and you're watching HSN at this moment or you're channel surfing, you're like, oh, what's going on? Everything's so unique and distinct. That's what's really, really fun about owning Jay's pieces. It's not like the mall stuff. You know, you're one of the mall, and I swear, the jewelry counters at one end of the mall, you walk clear to the end of the mall, and they could be the exact same store. Even, they really could. And they're buying all from the same people. Jay does not sell traditional retail. We're the only place that you can buy his beautiful pieces. We also skip a lot of the middlemen and stuff. You know, Jay is working directly with the miners. He's direct buying, and then he's creating with his team and then bringing it straight to us so we don't have the mall expenses of the rent and all that kind of stuff. We literally go straight from Jay to you. Thus, you're getting these incredible values. I think this is another really brilliant example of just exactly how talented and lucky we are to have Jay with us. All right, stay on the line for this one. We have five flex phase, and here are the magic earrings. I think they're darling. A lot of silver on them, actually. Very lightweight. They have a great little dangle to them, so 
They're fun to wear, playful as well. I love this pink color because obviously rhodochrosite can work with anything pink does. So think winter gray, winter white, navies look great with pink, brown and pink together. Fantastic. These are available. They come in at one and one six or one one sixteenth of an inch. <laughs> and again, very light, very easy to wear, very comfortable. Okay, coming back, we have something called Maiden Hair Turquoise. And you're like, what in the world is Maiden Hair Turquoise? Well, you gotta stick around to find out. Plus, we're gonna give you a peek at a couple of great deals coming up. If you want rocks from our favorite rock hound, we've got one more big hour with Jay just around the corner. I hope you can stay with me. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. Gift your best now and pay over time during HSN's Flex the Halls event. Create your merriest memories this season with five flex pay on everything now through Thanksgiving. Plus sale prices on Ninja and Calor. Flex the Halls now through Thursday. Tis the season to be a VIP. Use your HSN card to get the best deals on gifts for everyone. Shop now for the holidays and pay over time with extra flex or VIP financing on every item and at least eight VIP savings events a year. Plus, the HSN card has no annual fee. Not a card member? Apply now and instantly get $20 off when you're approved. Visit 